Welcome back, guys, to Star Fox Zero, as we've headed through a very weird teleport, where we ended up. Rob, give me my location. Location confirmed. You are on a former Cornarian base on Zonus. That's the Zonus base, all right. A poor base. Such a waste. The base is being protected by a giant energy shield. We can't reclaim the base while that shield is up. Turn off that shield, but do so without being spotted. Okay then, deactivate the shield as our phase one. Zone S, the land of, oh I was about to say, weird creatures and poison all around. There was definitely something there, wasn't there? Let's defeat you then, and then head through to an obvious little green switcheroo. Sure thing, I will leave it to you. I guess I can lower and get closer to you still. Oh, you can drag me. Beautiful, and it wouldn't be Zone S without searchlights, would it? Oh, joyous, joyous searchlights. Oh, and enemies. I don't know how I'm missing so much there, but let's dodge that. And stay low. Be careful around searchlights to avoid detection. Don't you worry about how far it can look. All these boxes then. Oh, explodey boxes, always good. Ah, hello! Ah, go away! Oh, I won't mind taking that. I mean, they give extra lives in the end. Ah, lovely. Silver coiny thing. As well as a massive searchlight with a possibility of turning it off, I guess. You know what? It'd probably be better to just pull you back and then go in myself. Beautiful. Right. Well, this is a difference to Zone S in that sense. Hello, where are you going? Make sure it does not kill me. It's one of my most important things. I pulled myself a little bit far away there, but if I give him some extra rope... Into a crazy bit of terrain. Right, so... No, I don't want you doing anything to me. Go away. Aha! Right. That's all fine. Well, first of all, searchlights galore. High energy detected in location to the left and right. Those energy beams appear to be powering the base's shields. Well, okay then. That they may be. Let's just turn off this really obviously trying to find me searchlight when I can. Is there anything in necessarily it was guarding? Can't open that. Nothing down there. Well, we'll destroy that in the meantime for a golden ring. Let's head this way then. Wasn't there like a ring this way as well? Imagining things am I. Alright, hello. Uh, bye bye. As soon as I finally get contact with that thing anyway. Alright then, so what am I doing? Where am I going? Someone's shooting at me, where are they? Oh, hello. Oh, we can destroy them, okay. Wasn't having good luck hitting those, was I? Right, oh, there's a silver ring down there, by the way. And boats as well. Okay, we dropped 
the whole thing on them. Hit plus eight. I'll take that. Another guy there standing right next to the ill-advised exploding box. Plus over here is a nice Distress little turn it off thing. Opening communications. This is Star Fox. Please respond. Oh, your music to my ears. I am sick to death of apes and monkeys. I managed to get shut into a shield generator. Mind busting me out, hon? Sure thing, but it seems I have to turn this off before I can even do that. Oh, that was a bit of drunk driving. Analysis in progress. Once this is off, I can maybe help you. Turning off these things seems to be one of my more important tasks. Another silver ring waiting, if we need it. And then down here is somewhere I have to go by the look of it. Can't quite fit there, but let's switch to the main view here. Analysis in progress. And after changing perspective, we see that we have opened up the way. However, where will that actually lead me? Okay, let's change the point of view yet again. And get that. Be aware of your surroundings it definitely is an extra life then. Don't worry, I'm aware of surroundings. And there's Cat. Wouldn't be Zone S without you, my dear. You actually came through for me. And they say chivalry is dead. Why don't you try hacking the control panels nearby? Sure. Doing that should deactivate the shield generator. That one looks a bit more complicated, though. All the same, let's start with these. Ah! What shot me? Oi! Evil thing. Well, I'm above the rotating lasers. That's always a good thing. Make sure I'm not running into what seems to be a powered up wall. Ah, another enemy we see, right. Let us target that one. Has that turned off one of the lasers? It looks to me like I'm supposed to lower you into the laser's path. Yep. And you just got cut off the rope. <laughs> it's probably your lifeline. Good going, little man. Let's do my place next time. See ya, Foxy boy. Okay, see ya. I'm glad we can help and all. Can I get out here? No. Anything else to do in here? Collectibilities? I do not know. All the same, it looks like we're going out the top again. Good! Now take out that other shield generator so our fleet can attack. Just one more generator to go. Well, with that in mind, let's try to avoid... Oh, hello. Even more of these things. These searchlights. Because, well, Zone S, you've got a good thing for avoiding them all before. If we can avoid them all, who knows? We might get another mission accomplished, because it seems like that might be something better than mission complete. Especially because it's in gold. Otherwise, it's the medium route. And then we just get confused. Huh? I thought he said that. Oh, beautiful. I didn't know they were giving me prompts for that, but it seems we now have the ability to drop bombs on things. I said, however, um, we'll just release the bomb there. Bring you back in and try to get that golden thing with while avoiding the evils there. It looks like I might be going up there, by the way. So it looks to me like there was a path up here. Yep. Oh, hello. Let's 
take you out of range. We got a light there, which is not on, which, to be honest, I'm going to keep it that way. And just dodge that enemy, even though we do need hit score to get medals and all. Okay, something's firing at me, and I don't know where. It's behind me, I think it's that guy. Okay, let's stay down low. Okay, that's fire, that's never a good thing. I was about to say, there must be something here for me. Keep turning you things off. Alright, that's our destination. First of all, we make sure this thing doesn't hit me. And then we wonder about... Can we destroy any of these? By the look of it? No, is the answer to that. Hello. Well, there's another gold ring there for one another extra life, but still. Just wandering around, seeing if there's anything that we can use to shut off that light. Because I don't want to set them off. And there was something over there then, wasn't there? I do wonder what's going on with that light there. Can I just go and run there? Oh, what? I didn't even see that light look this way. Now we are in chaos. Quick hit that. I think that dealt with it. Yes, that dealt with our situation. But I got spotted. I didn't want to get spotted. Okay, there's another one there, and hello. Let's just blow you sky high. It's those boss boats. Well, that said, we'll just go down here. Down. And give Direct Eye another little poke around. But it doesn't look like I'm really getting anywhere at the moment. So I definitely activated something. But I was too busy watching out for all the monsters wanting to kill me to notice what it actually was. It's the fact that we've opened it up. Probably not good to walk into that beam, so let's go down nicely. In fact, there's a box there, which I will shoot using first-person view. I'll take that for an extra life. This is a definitely a slower-paced mission, if anything. Leave it to you. Well, it seems they're getting one at a time here. In terms of coins. Okay, let's not walk into that. And let's see where I'm going. It seems to be upwards looking things this time. I was about to say, there must be some enemies around here. And there are indeed. So let's just stick close to this pillar for the time being. And then find out what on earth it is we're doing. If you want us to get down, turn around, it's probably going to be better looking from the outside edge inwards. Aha! So we have something we need to land on that retreats. said though, let's give it a go and get you onto here. Right, so perspective wise, you can fire as well. Didn't realise that, but when a big obvious red switch appears we will do something with it. So there must be some even closer to the edge here, so let's just hug it. There we go. Leave it to you. Switch to his view. ourselves another coin there in the meantime. The base's self-destruct sequence has been activated. Immediate evacuation is recommended. 
and do something stupid. Looks like it's time to exit, little man. Care to escort me? I would like to point out, I'm not exactly in the fastest of ships. And where are you, cat? Over there, great. Ladies first. Don't fall behind. Feel free. Another searchlight. Oh, you're going down there, are you? Okay, cat, I'll follow you, I believe. Oh, I've been spotted. Well, I just got to get out in one minute, so let's just go up and look around. Hello, uh, things. All die, please. I'm out of here. Oh, we didn't find those coins. We have escaped the Zone S base. Mission complete. Spotted by a searchlight, sure. You sure know how to entertain a lady. Later, Foxy Boy. And it seems the great fox has come to find us. I bet I know we're near gold here. Oh, not too far off. A little bit more enemy killing we'd have got there. In our covert ops that didn't end up so covert. Even the escape route had more searchlights craziness. The walker has been equipped with a new function. It is now able to hack computers, just like Direct Eye. Well, that sounds useful. What are these kind of like... Oh, that's the warp that took us from here to there. Okay, two more areas complete. Only one extra medal since all of that. Well, they are done. We move on to Sector Beta. Next time, by the look of it, join me then for more Star Fox Zero as we continue on with all the crazy contraptions. Will it be an R-Wing mission? You never know. I think we're due a Landmaster one at this point in time. I'll see you then for more. Bye-bye.